Can you describe what you saw in your freshman quarterback starting first SEC game on the road today? Yeah, I saw a lot of confidence in him. Uh, he definitely had a little bit of swagger to him. He came in this game, he didn't seem like a freshman at all. He seemed like he'd been starting four years at this university, and um, he balled out and he played a heck of a game. And I'm very thankful that um, you know he came here with his mind right like that and got the job done. The last few games, you guys have been struggling to run the football today. Didn't have as many problems. Was it something different? Did y'all change schemes or supposed to do? Um, I think it's re really just the attitude that we took into this game. We had those uh, three setbacks earlier in the season. We had that bye week, and you know we really just pushed. We got to be more physical and nasty on the line, and um, every single day. That's that's our thing. We're not we're not worried about you know exactly the scheme as much as just being nasty and moving guys. And I think that helped us out a lot with the run game today. You guys kind of like having the setback on the right side. Uh, I mean, it didn't make it didn't really make a difference to me. He's a great player. Uh, he can play on both sides, but uh, you know, we just in your injury situation, he went back there, and I think I talked to him after the game, and he said he played a great game. So I mean, he can get it done at both sides. Can you, can you explain what this does to you guys going into the next week? Uh, it's just another confidence booster. Um, we keep on, you know, these past two weeks, no one really believed in us. And I don't know what it is, but I feel like we always do our best when no one believes in us. And everyone turns their heads on us. And <clears throat> I think we just thrive in that situation. But, um, you know, we can't we can't just gloat on this one for too long, you know. We'll celebrate it tonight, and we'll get back in there and watch the film and see what we did right, see what we did wrong, and just move on this next week. Um, like I said, that bye week was a it was a big deal, and we really emphasize energy and effort and stuff like that. And um, there's just there was an attitude and atmosphere in the locker room before the game. I don't know what it was, but guys just were really excited to play, and it seemed almost as if, as if, as if everyone had bought into it. You know, just energy, getting excited about stuff, celebrating with your with your brothers, and um, it's just before the game I could tell something was different. Like you guys were struggling late to move the football, had to rely on your defense to make big plays. They made two of them. It's how huge was that down the stretch? Well, I mean, I, I was, I was, that was awesome. That was huge. Those guys did a great job. I mean, their goal line stop, my jaw dropped to the ground. I was in shock. And then that bad snap that they had, it was just, it, it was almost unbelievable. I was just standing there and making sure that, you know, there wasn't some flag or something like that. And for them to come off with both those turnovers, that was huge. Anything else for Mike? Sweet.